Check out this Christmassy live wallpaper. Here is a fun little Christmas project for you to do in Python. Let's dive into it. So here is the Python code. Essentially, we set the variables for the animation and then we, we start drawing the snowflakes and we trigger a recording function which captures screenshots of the animation on a timely basis. Here I set it after every second. And after the animation is complete, we exit the window. The function eps to gif will convert all the frames we've saved into a gif animation. So let's see how this is done. When I click run, here's the animation. We can see the draw function has been triggered and the snowflakes are being drawn. And now if I show you the folder which this code is in, you can see that the frames are being saved continuously after every single second. So that's what this function is doing, this save function. And after 10 snowflakes has been drawn, this is the last one. And when I click cross, then this function starts running and converting all of these frames into an animated GIF. If you run into an OS error when running this EPS to GIF function, it means you don't have Ghost Script installed. So to fix this, we can go into git bash and run this command, conda install go script. Let's do that. Okay, and that's done. Once that's done, we remove all of those frames so it doesn't clutter your folder. Okay, so after having this GIF file, how do we make it play in the background? We go to this website where we can upload the GIF and convert it to an MP4 file. So if we choose file, we choose this GIF file that we just created, click open, upload and here it is um, there are a few options which you can do like adding reverse effects to the animation let's click convert and now we have ourselves a forward and rewind animation in mp4 format now we save this let me rename this animated.mp4 okay now the final step is to make it appear in your desktop background to do that, we'll give you the link for this software. This software basically allows you to select the live wallpaper. So if I select this animated.mp4 and then I click play, this will play any video in your desktop background on loop. So that's a cool little project. Um, the code will be linked in the description and all the references as well. I hope you like this. Leave a comment below if you did.